So we're going to go straight inside your mind. So what I want you to do... Can you please ask for consent? Is it okay if yes. we enter your mind? Okay. Yes. Thank you. No problem. Welcome to Inside My Mind, where we get into celebrities' heads to see what's really going on in there. Just to be clear, I am not trained or licensed to do this. Today we have Quinta Brunson with us. Hello. Comedic genius, actress, producer, director, other things. Exactly. So today we are going to go inside your mind, and hopefully we'll get to know you a little better. Hopefully you'll get to know yourself a little better. I hope so. I'm ready. Relax yourself. And as you're doing these breaths, I want you to think of a mantra that you can say to yourself. Some that'll put you at ease. On every exhale, just say it out loud. Belly button, nipple. That's what relaxes you, that's what relaxes you. I didn't you. say it relaxed me, it's just the words that came to mind. So, as you're breathing, there's a room forming around you. Just get a little more in touch with this room. What does this room look like? It's a white room with four corners. What's in there? Nothing. Just me sitting there, chilling, looking cute. How do you feel in this room? Good, I like it. It's a good space. You feel safe, you feel comfortable? Mm-hmm. There's a door. All right, well, when you're ready, let's uh, get up and walk through that door. I'm, I'm through it. Should I have told you that? Yeah, that would have been oh, helpful. Okay, right I'm here. through the door. All right, so now we're in a new environment. It's a bunch of flowers, a bunch of beautiful flowers everywhere, and they're like growing on vines. Tell me a little more about these flowers, the colors. They're like wildflowers, and they're like hand-drawn, um, like that old drawing of that that cartoon that we used to watch when we were little is that little man with the big pencil. The big oh, I remember. You know what oh, I'm talking about? Yeah, Harold. Yeah. It's, but it looked like he painted these flowers. And I'm just walking in there, looking around and stuff. Let's look up. What's the ceiling look like? Uh, like, I don't know. And this, like, black pit looking thing. Like, oh my God, it looks like in Stranger Things when, um, the upside down. Yeah. But they got barbed. But they're not about to get me. You feel any presence of anybody there? No, it's just dirty and barren and black. And like, it's like, it's just gross. But I've brushed it off. I'm up already. I'm about to walk out of here. Hey, yeah, let's walk out. Let's say this room you just walked into is a garage. Mm -hmm. And in this garage, there's a bike. You get on the bike. And you're just traveling through. How's the scenery looking? Is it changing? Yeah. It's going from like city. I'm just like a bike messenger now. I'm not even me anymore. I'm like a guy named Greg on a bike. <laughs> Riding around, just trying to get to my next job, you know? It's hard out here in the city. I almost got hit by a car. What kind of car was it? I don't know. It was like a big moving truck. You get out to cuss the driver off? No, I don't have time. I need to drop off these pizzas. Greg's over it. I don't want to be Greg anymore. <laughs> Pull it to the first mirror you see, the first reflective surface. And whatever you see in there, whatever Greg looks like, try to shed Greg. Try to shank him? Sh <laughs> yes, everything that's making you Greg, just take some breaths and get the Greg out. So what kind of surface did uh, you look into? Was it a window, a mirror? I went into my apartment. It's cute. Oh, what's your apartment look like? I don't know. I think this is something else. I don't like, I think it's something I saw in a movie. Like, or I don't know. It's like a very blue and like cute, chic apartment. And um, I have a nice kitchen, a lot of pillows. I don't know who this, if, if I would not go with these styling choices. And now she's laid on the bed, and she's just like smiling, looking at TV. So maybe this is a good point to kind of come back. So as you're laying in bed, mm -hmm. just kind of fall asleep and take those deep breaths, and with every breath, you're coming back to our world. Like this one? This one, where you're okay. normal, Quinta. OK. I'm back. Yeah, you're back. 
Welcome back. Thank you. What a journey. How did that feel? Crazy. That was pretty cool. What's Greg's life like? You feel bad for him? Feel good for him? No, I think he's okay. I don't think he has a girlfriend. Oh, poor Greg. Thank you for coming out here and taking the time out of your busy day. Thank you. I think it deserves an Oscar. So, until somebody else wants to do this weird shit with us again, um, see you then. Can I just say your excitement is contagious? Yeah, having a smoke weed yet today is just like, you know, that's usually when I get excited. Yeah. Can't wait.